Hey everyone, I'm Sharif Mansour, the OWASP uh, Chair. Um, I have some exciting updates for you today. So um, as we're working um, on the Black Hat virtual booth, um, one exciting announcement uh, that we have is with regards to corporate membership. So I'm going to quickly share my screen and sort of explain what we're doing. So right now the OWASP uh, foundation is going to update um, the mo or the corporate membership tiers and um, the benefits that we give corporate members just like we have membership benefits for individual members we're going to be doing uh, the same for uh, corporates as well um, so what I'll do is quickly show you um, uh, through the website what we have and what we've changed and like um, the individual membership, which is something near and dear to my heart, the pricing is also based on where you are in the world, what, you know, what, um, which country the uh, um, company is registered in, because not all companies can afford the same thing. And so we've done it also by region and also whether or not you count as a startup. And I'll explain exactly what we mean by a startup. So hopefully that will encourage um, a lot more companies to become a um, member of the OAS Foundation. And if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out or DM me for any questions. Uh, so I'm just going to quickly exit uh, the screen here and show you what I mean. So if you go to the About menu uh, on the OAS site, you'll see Corporate Membership. And you've clicked there, you'll notice a couple of things, which is we've now added a section for the new packaging and prices for corporate members. And um, this will be really important. So um, the first thing is we have changed it to be uh, by tier, so silver, gold, and platinum. And each one of them has uh, different types of uh, membership, but the way, if you're interested, basically click on this button. And the pricing for each um, uh, tier can be found here. And this is, the standard is if you're a, a country in sort of um, um, uh, in, in the US and other sort of developed nations, if you are in um, a, a region that uh, is uh, developing, for example, um, uh, there's another tier. And then if you're a startup, and remember I mentioned um, what we consider a startup, and that is a company that um, is within 24 months of its um, inception. Um, so that's another $10,000. And if you're a startup in sort of one of those regions, then it's uh, $4,000. So um, so the range varies, um, and that is also to reflect sort of the commitment that the organization is trying to perform versus how much, where they are in the world. So, um, so let's go through the, the different tiers. So the first thing is there's, um, the first one is corporate membership support logo. So you'll have the different tier, you'll be able to put in um, the support logo. You have a OASP uh, trademark license. So this is if you want to. A lot of your organ, a lot of organizations, for example, value the um, OASP logo and the OASP brand. Um, outside of fair use, um, if you want to take the relationship for, for, uh, forward and basically use the, the OASP logo and trademark, um, there is an agreement here on what you're eligible for and what, what, it, mean, uh, what it means. Um, and that's one um, product or services in silver, five in gold and platinum, it's unlimited. So if you're a large organization that specializes in AppSec and has a lot of products and so forth, then that, that's what it means. Um, sponsorship, um, participating uh, AppSec days, um, Global access early registration discount. This is means that for your staff, um, if they want sort of discounts um, for uh, uh, global AppSec, then you're eligible. Um, your brand on OS.org. So obviously, uh, we'll thank you for on that respect. Um, uh, rotation uh, 
uh, opportunities. So this is how often sort of the site, uh, your name at the bottom sort of uh, is uh, regularly shown. And then the social media recognition. So this is how often you can sort of read, um, uh, partner with us um, with, with regards to social media. So this is um, uh, what they mean here. So they can take a look at it there. And then finally, go global AppSec sponsorship early access. So this is early access to be able to for, for sponsorship. New article upon signing, corporate um, sponsorship subsidy, and uh, global um, uh, ambassador. Sorry, ambassador for the global board of uh, uh, election vote, which means that you can assign one person that can run for election. Sorry, it can vote. Um, uh, as part of the OSP uh, election um, uh, to represent your corporation. Um, but essentially, those are all the uh, um, uh, the different tiers. And uh, yeah, so the platinum, um, uh, the standard is $25,000. For annum, the gold is 15000 The silver is $5,000. And if you're... Um, uh, a startup in a regional um, um, in specific areas that we consider um, uh, that are eligible for that. And this is how we do it. Any organization that's for, uh, headquartered in emerging markets or developing country, as defined by the IMF World Economic Table E, um, that is not a low tax country. So for example, it's not like in Bahamas, like um, a British Virgin Island, which is um, a tax haven, um, as long as it's in the IMF World Economic Forum Outlook Table E, um, you are eligible for uh, considered regional or a regional startup. And that also makes us uh, a global foundation. We have global values versus um, values from specific nations and so on. Um, and this is something I'm really proud of. So. I hope this has been helpful. If you find this interesting, then uh, a simple thing that you can do is just simply click on About Us. That will take you to the um, Contact Us page, uh, rather. Um, you can actually sort of um, uh, make a request here um, for people to get in touch. Um, and our staff will, re um, will hear back from you and um, what we're looking forward to uh, hearing about you and getting in touch. So um, thank you very much. Have a great day. And um, I hope you consider becoming an OS corporate sponsor.